What up, y'all? It's motherfucking Red, and this is my artist exclusive with Key Baby E and T. Look at here, look at here. Hey. We got Red Jebbin in the house. What's up, girl? What's up, Key? How you doing? What's going on? See you, girl. What uh, you think? Come up in your hand. Girl, I see you uh, got your new shoes on. I do, y'all. Y'all know. On, they know man. I keep the converse on me. Look, nothing too crazy. Just they clean, they white. On there they got some little pearls, you know, for the yeah, girls. Real good without y'all. We got real happy <laughs> up in here today, y'all. Uh, she came in showing out, showing out. Yeah. Let's get right into it, girl. This, um, how did you get the name Red Velvet? Uh, so I got the name Red Velvet when I was in college a long time ago. Not, not a long time ago, y'all. But um, so I felt like red, the color red, demonstrate every emotion. Okay. So it can mean sad, you know, you see red, you mad, you see red. So and, this is like your favorite color? No, it's not, but I just felt like emotions. And I'm an emotional person. And then velvet is like my soft side, so I put those together. Okay. Plus everybody love cake, you know? So. Okay, I like that. Right. Um, yes. yeah. They got a um, nice little ring to them too and stuff. Mm -hmm. So, um, where you from? So, I'm from the suburbs, y'all. Suburbs um, from Skokie, Illinois. That's where I grew up. But I'm currently staying in the city. Okay, so yeah. shout out to Skokie. Yeah, Skokie. Skokie. Okay, Skokie in the house. Fair. What's your zone up in Chicago? Uh, so, my mom's side of the family from here. And then after I got out of college, I moved here. Just more opportunity. You know, I'm doing music. It's a better scene for it. That's why I'm out here. And, you know, everybody loves Chicago. They view. Yeah, I'll be sure to do a shirt. I had to say shirt back to Chicago. Right. Mm -hmm. The one city. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, I don't like that shot back. Y'all no, yeah, gotta stop yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. It's nothing like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Give it a little, the wrong ring, so mm -hmm. it's not like people scared. Right, right. Don't even sound right. Like that, rocking something. Man, I'm like, yeah. We don't need those problems, but um, uh, what inspired you to be a female uh, artist? So you know, some people might hate me, but I love Nicki Minaj. I don't care. Um, so she inspired me, okay, um, and then the I do. I love her. Okay. Shout out to you, Nikki. <laughs> um, and then in college, I met um, a couple other artists. They was like, "You should just do music. You already do spoken word. You do poetry." So I just that's how that's how it happened. What age you began on the right? Or what age did you start? Mm, I, I've been writing my whole life. Like I've been had a diary, a journal. I always writing poems, so I can say since I was like five. Yes, since I was five, we write over here. Now this song of yours, man, you got me real curious and interested in this song, girl. Um, mm -hmm. The Gripper Slipper. Let's talk a little about that. Gripper Slipper. Name of it. Gripper Slipper. Yeah, fight. You know what the Gripper Slipper is, girl? No, no. Nah. <laughs> I said, hey, what did she get here? I got to know. Yeah. I got to know. So y'all, I feel like you know, if you got you got ladies, if you got that thing on you, and you know how to, you know how to, <laughs> okay, real baby, you know okay, how to okay. squeeze it, you not know, bad. tighten up at the right times. No, that's it, not real baby, right mm, there. That's that grip or slipper, you know. It grips and it slips. Oh, okay, okay. That yeah, slipper. yeah. I hear that fellas, that mm -hmm. grip or slipper outside, yeah. mm -hmm. outside of Chicago, now. <laughs> <laughs> Now that's all you got. I got another um, question for you. Mm -hmm. P and L. Oh, yeah. No, I think you uh, won last time on that before. I didn't win. I should have won. No, I'm just playing y'all, but I didn't win. 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 You know, whatever you wanted to mean, but because some of y'all been been a little freaky saying what it means, so you know. Right, so I'm back around here. Mm -hmm. P and F, y'all heard yeah. what she said. So man. whatever y'all want it to be, that's what it is. Okay, when you're not working and stuff, like what do you do on your free time? Um, so I chill with my partner. Um, I'll go out with my sister a lot. 
we go outside. I'm always networking. I try to support other artists and their events. Yeah, no, that's um, right. Cause like yeah. you don't want to do that. Like you gotta, you got. It's right. a give and take. You can't just expect everybody to yeah, come for exactly. you. And you're not going showing up for them. So I try to do that, support my friends and just upcoming artists. That's all we need to support. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Yeah. Now, I heard you say something about your partner. Um, you know, I don't I don't really speak too much on that because I feel like that's that's something I do keep private, I always have. Um, but I'm happy. Okay. I'm blessed. I'm blessed. I'm happy. Um, I'm taken care of, you know, peace is beautiful. It's a beautiful thing. So y'all should get y'all some. They got to, they got to bring something. You take it away from it. You got to go. You got to go. You know what I mean? That's a fact. Now, if you had a chance to collaborate with any artist I had today that we see on TV today, mm -hmm. who would it be? Mm -hmm. I love this question. So it will be Drake, y'all. Um, I love him. I love his lyricism, his artistry. He collab with everybody, his influence, and he's been doing it for a long time. So definitely will be Drake. Yeah, he's most definitely out there. Mm -hmm. He's been in the spotlight lately too mm -hmm. for a lot of other things. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I see he's multi talented though. Like, I guess that's where his power is. So. Absolutely. I see mm -hmm. like to be Drake. So. Okay, Drake, you hear my girl with that? Right. Come, Come check on. Out. Um, Come man. on. Come on. We'll get on this collaboration <laughs> with this girl, man. Come on, because I want to hear it too. Man. Now, if you have to describe your music, um, what would it be like? Uh, my music is it, different. It's empowering. It's it's about finding your voice. I feel like I make music for women, empowering, but at the same time, I still have fun. Yeah. It's abstract. Wow. It's different. I'm going to ride any beat. I can fit in any genre, I really think so. That's what we kind of yeah. use today and stuff because mm -hmm. everybody kind of making the same kind the of music. The same stuff. That's all you The same message. I'm like, what a new message is saying? What exactly. it says? Like, come exactly. on, man. Everybody look the same. Yeah. They got the same flow. No identity. Mm -hmm. no. no type of identity. No. Yeah. But we're going to pray for my girls. You know, we got real bad right here. She finna show out. So Absolutely. Out. Absolutely. Out, you know what I mean? Come on. You know what I mean? On the mm -hmm. album. Yeah. What's the name of your album? My album is called I Know It's Been a While. And I dropped that in December of last year. I know it's been a while. Mm -hmm. What's that kind of about? It's, it's it, it just, it just yeah. So I named it that because um this is my first project um after changing my name um to R E D D V L V T. It used to be what was it before? It was the same thing, but it was R E D D V E L V E T. Okay, I took the E's out. Yeah. Um, so this was my first album, my first like solo album um, that I did on my own, paid for and everything. It, it took a lot of money, took a lot of work, took a lot of time. And so that that caused me not to drop an album for a minute. Y'all don't be knowing like artists, albums can't just drop every six months, a good one at least. Y'all right. can keep dropping music, but I like to drop quality. So it's like, I know it's been a while so to my fans. Time, yeah. yeah. So you want mm -hmm. to be perfect. Mm -hmm. Put it out. Uh, yeah. Is that like one of your favorite songs, or do you have a favorite song on your uh, album? Uh, my favorite song on the album is "Make It Happen." I'm sure y'all heard it, maybe not, but it's on all streaming platforms. It'd be like booty soft as hell, got a little something to smack your meat on. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. how I go. Yeah. So uh, <laughs> it okay. is. It okay. is inspired. Is it, is it video tour yet? Not yet. So I'm gonna shoot that video hopefully this summer. I need some beautiful ladies. Men, I'm not discriminating. Yeah, come, come and get in the video. So I might announce soon. that. That's coming soon. So hopefully we can all get together and shoot that and make it happen. Okay. Yeah. You got somebody of a particular film the video for you? Uh, not yet, not yet. So I'm looking for somebody to shoot it too. You know? I'm about to come outside with you. Probably let me know real quick. Yeah. Outside with you, girl. Period. Yeah. Period. Yes, Key, come yeah, through. Um, <laughs> if they want to find you, what can the people find you at? Um, y'all, I'm on all streaming platforms. Like I said, R E D D V L B T. Um, Apple, YouTube, Spotify, Title, Amazon Music, all that. And then on um, yeah, uh -huh, all that, music. all that. And then Instagram is M R Z R E D D underscore underscore. Same for Twitter. Y'all can't have my Snapchat. So yeah. Oh, so <laughs> y'all don't get no snapping her over there. Yeah. Man, okay. not snapping me nothing. Yeah. Well, y'all, yeah, this is my girl, Rivet.
Uh, she came out and showed out, you yes, know. Thank y'all. Gave us the exclusive, exclusive um, mm-hmm. interview. Yeah, mm-hmm. I appreciate you coming to give us that. Yeah. 411, as I of should course. say. Thank Did y'all. That 411? I, don't <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if they say it, but I know what you meant. I got, I'm, I'm, I'm with you. That's all I'm saying. My I'm girls, with my you. Girls, my girls, y'all. Again, y'all, that's real baby. I'm fucking with Key Baby. Entertainment. Uh, Let's go. Let's go. All right, y'all. That was my artist exclusive with Key Baby ENT. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. And I also want to thank the fans for tuning in to the latest episode of Infinite Heat. My episode featuring me was called, uh, I think it was the Red Edition. So check that out. And thank y'all for voting once again. And stay tuned for more things that Key Baby got coming for more updates from Cannabis Infusions. And more updates from Infinite Heat. And I'll be outside too this summer. So please go and um, follow me on Instagram to stay up to date. Thank y'all. I feel like a bird. What's the word? Don't on, don't disturb. Think I'm feeling mine. This thing gets reserved. Okay, I came first. Cause I'm never second. And I put in work. Threw it back. Put it in reverse. All he do is curse. Open up. Told him blow this cake out like it's 21st. Hey, come blow this cake out like it's 21st. I'm the coldest winner. And my booty bigger. Come get with the winner. Shake it in the mirror when I'm up and